This feature is the uh, personal user files. A uh, cool, cool feature that will allow you to, um, to store your customers' uh, save games, their keyboard configurations, the uh, setups of the game interfaces. Let's say they've set up World of Warcraft in certain ways or maybe they use Adobe Photoshop for different features and they've set up the whole interface and the way they like to work with it and that you can actually store uh, in the smartphones and the next time the customer comes back, no matter which computer he sits down by, by the way, uh, you'll be able to instantly load in have his or her um, save games and configs. It could also be used for personal documents, for instance Word and Excel so forth. So as you can imagine, all of this is a great way to, for you to build kind of actually an entry barrier for your competitors because uh, your customers will slowly invest more and more uh, time into your cafe and they will build up a lot of uh, safe games, conflicts and so forth that will make them much more likely to stay at your cafe uh, versus other cafes, competing cafes or even versus staying at home. Uh, if they have all the great face, uh, safe games at your cafe, why would they play at home when they can uh, play at your cafe, have the great service with all the product ordering and so forth. So, so obviously this feature can help you a lot uh, to increase loyalty and increase advocacy. So uh, let me just quickly demonstrate how easy it actually is to set up. Uh, inside the SmartOn server, you go to application management and under personal user files, uh, you can create different uh, setups for each of the games or applications you might have in the cafe. So let's just say I want to set up one for Diablo 3, for instance. I'm going to choose on demand because that means that it will only be copied to the client computer once the customer starts playing this game. So that will save you a lot of uh, network bandwidth. Uh, then I'm going to set up the, um, the path I, I want to use. So this is not the real one. I'm just going to use that as an example. But let's say there's some safe games for the single player missions in Diablo, something like that. Then you would uh, include all the different files uh, in that folder and click apply. And that will basically uh, have you, uh, then you would basically have set up the whole thing in smartphones and smartphones will take care of rest, uh, the rest here. So I've actually set up one here in the call Diablo 3 already uh, and we only need to do one last thing and that is to sell smartphones well which game is actually using this personal user file so it knows when to copy this. And of course we have a game called uh, Diablo 3 in this case. I'm just going to go in and edit it and under Puff and Licensing I can now activate it under personal user files here and that will do it. So as you can see, it takes only a few minutes to set up. Uh, the tricky part is to figure out the path, uh, usually, of where to save it. Uh, that, well, it, but it's not that tricky. And uh, of course, our supporters are standing by, helping you, ready to help you out with that. And we do also have a cool form, which I'll in, encourage you also to search inside, because lots of other cafes are sharing uh, inside our community uh, what they've discovered, and, and especially, for instance, how to use the personal user files and also the license management feature. Okay, good. So I think I have to